Hello, my name's Clay and Kaz is behind the camera. Welcome to draw 530, 15 Low Street, also known as the Bromley, named after a local predominant artist with roots here in the Mundi community. I'm gonna take you for a tour of the garden areas and show you some of the nuts and bolts of the property. Come and have a look with me. So we've got these beautiful gardens that come up along the driveway here, which we've mulched. Behind the gardens is our native bush area. Look at this fantastic home. There's trees from everywhere. We've got all our native trees. Then we've got our introduced species, such as our cactus, persimmon trees, Brazilian nut trees. Um, over across the front of the house, we've got birch, tropical birch trees. This garden is absolutely magnificent. You need to see it to believe it. Look at the front of this house. It's just gorgeous. So here's our outdoor storage area. So if you've got a little rider mower and all your garden tools can be kept nice and safe in here. So we're coming into the backyard area. We've got this magnificent mango tree here. We've also got a lovely garden between the two, between the two structures. And our clothesline's just around the corner here, wall mounted clothesline, and we've got a veggie patch up on the hill. We've got our beautiful orange trees here, our veggie patch. To our right, we've got the lemon trees, limes. Um, fantastic veggie patch here, all set up, ready to go. This morning, I've just been planting some additional lettuce, some zucchinis, um, some additional parsley, some beans over here, more parsley here. You'll love this. If you've got a green thumb and you're the winner, this is an ideal home for you. We've also got this half rainwater tank here that the old owners were using for aquaponics. Um, so yeah, you could certainly plant this, put some fish in here, add more water plants in here. Fantastic. No maintenance at all. So coming down here to this garden in front of the beautiful master bedroom, you're looking out at the pool area and these magnificent tropical birch trees. Now we are shooting in winter, um, so they are deciduous at the moment. They've dropped 99% of their leaves, but these trees are absolutely magnificent. I love them. They're just fantastic. I love the way at the bottom, they've got the little succulent gardens as well. It just looks fantastic. So another great feature about this property and another little section of the garden is this fire pit area. This is the greatest fire pit I've ever seen. Absolutely fantastic, all set up, ready to go. We've got the rocks surrounding it so you can be sitting down, enjoying a nice afternoon or an evening by the fire pit. As well as its beautiful manicured lawns and gardens, we've got this natural bush area here. You know, it's just wonderful to be in touch with nature. Kaz and I before just moved a couple of logs around and, and to make a yarning circle and Kaz just bu built this lovely little fairy garden here for the little ones to have a play with. So we've got a beautiful garden there with a boab tree next to the pool. Coming down here to this magnificent fish pond. Um, this is only a snippet of the beautiful gardens here. Um, it doesn't do the property justice. There's rock walls, there's paving, there's stone steps. You name it, this property's got it. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the garden tour. If you haven't already, please make sure you buy a ticket. All money raised goes towards all the great things your town does, including powering kids' helpline, our domestic violence shelters, and training and employment for young people. Thank you very much for your time, and looking forward to meeting you, the winner.